income. Let's turn our attention to the health service now. Uh, the Wolfson Economics Prize is calling for new ideas on how to radically improve hospitals for patients and staff. The prize has been launched in partnership with the Think Tank Policy Exchange. Uh, Boris Johnson announced last year that, that uh, £3.7 billion worth of funding towards new hospitals in England and 40 will be built, he says, by 2030. But how would you modernise the NHS? Uh, well, Lord Wilson, uh, Conservative peer, Chief Executive of Next and founder of the prize in 2011, joins me now. Uh, good morning, Lord Wilson. Good morning. Uh, so what's the, what's the big question here that you're hoping that people might find the answers to? So what we're looking for is answers really to four, really, you know, straightforward questions, but with very complicated answers. We want to see how people <laughs> would, would uh, improve patient experiences, clinical outcomes, staff well-being, and the way that hospitals are integrated into the wider healthcare network in their communities, um, in order to make the best use of this money that government is about to spend on forty new hospitals. And, and I, I suppose that, that, that maybe we've all thought a lot more about the health service and how it works or doesn't in the last year. So can can anyone enter the prize? Yep, anyone can enter the prize. And in fact, we're looking for lots of different points of view. Um, you know, so, um, for example, someone who's got exper experience of industrial catering will have a huge amount to add to how hospitals can better deliver hot food to patients on time in such a way that those meals are both nutritious and, and warm when they get them. Um, People who work in hospitals from the most senior surgeons right down to people who work as hospital porters will have thoughts about how hospitals could be better designed. I mean, you know, talking about hospital porters, just the way that beds, patients, staff, clinicians move around hospitals could be vastly improved if you start from scratch. Building wards near and easily accessible to um, theatres, for example, would make an enormous difference to the speed and efficiency with which people go from uh, their hospital bed to a to a ward to, to a theatre to a recovery area and back to their ward that that can make an enormous difference to clinical outcomes and it's one of the i suppose it's one of the things which when you're building a, a hospital from scratch you can sort of start right from the beginning and and you know apply common sense what it might be what the things you can't do in existing buildings necessarily but just say right okay this is a blank sheet of paper um uh this is what we're going to do for, for, with new hospitals how does someone go about if someone's listening to this and thinking i've got an idea uh, how does someone go about entering what's the process okay well, good. No, great question thank you go to the policy exchange website um and look at the wolfson prize on there which you'll find on the home page and um it's all set out there how you can go about entering uh, there are basically two rounds there's a first round which anyone can enter. Um, we're looking for a submissions around 10,000 words. And what we'll then do after a period of time is we will sift those down to five finalists who will then get the opportunity to develop their ideas further in a 25,000 word submission. And we're looking to announce a winner in November. Uh, with a top prize of? Qu quarter of a million pounds quarter of a million pounds uh, well i mean i'm sure it, it'd be brilliant if a uh if a uh, times radio listener was listening now thought, oh, i have got an idea and they put the pen to paper and do that so yeah you can go to policyexchange.org.uk that's uh that's lord wolfson they're really good to speak to you here on times radio um there's the uh wolfson uh prize which has been uh, launched today the wolfson economics prize that is go to policyexchange.org.uk if you've if you've got an idea to improve the nhs um make new hospitals work better I think we've probably all got some ideas on that. Uh, yeah, then you can do that uh, this morning.